The mansion that plastic surgery and reality television built, sold for $55 million. The owners of the 22,000 square feet 14 bedroom mega mansion in Newport Beach, California are Terry and Heather Dubrow. Terry Dubrow is an American plastic surgeon and a television personality. He is the co host of E Network's Botched and appears on The Real Housewives of Orange County with his wife, Heather. Heather Dubrow, nicknamed Fancy Pants, is an American personality and an American actress. Heather is a cast member of the television series The Real Housewives of Orange County from 2012 to 2016 and rejoined the cast in 2021. In 2000, she portrayed Lydia DeLuca in the television series That's Life. The over-the-top mega mansion is known as the Dubrow Chateau. Some of the opulent amenities consist of a champagne button in Heather's primary bedroom closet, a towel warming drawer, a 21-seat movie theater, a pinball machine in the hallway, and an entryway featuring a vaulted 30-foot ceiling. Heather's interior decorating for Tay is all over the home. She decorated the home all by herself opting for textures, material, and color palettes in neutral colors. She also incorporated textures like wood, stone, and leather. In most of the rooms she repeated the elements by keeping the same tones and fabrics but in different colors. The Dubrow Chateau was supposed to be their dream home, the home that was supposed to keep them and their family planted for a while. In the last 22 years, they have moved into 18 residences and has never lived in any of these homes for more than three years. Heather stated that the Dubrow Chateau was the only residence that felt really like their home. The couple's family room has restoration hardware elements with both luxury and elegance in mind. It's an open-concept kitchen family room and it's as large as three-quarters of a football field. The luxury modern kitchen has chrome accents throughout the room and the statement Marble Island was built to entertain, where guests can stand around, mingle, and chat. The outrageous primary bedroom is massive, but yet cozy. The bedroom is opulent and lush with neutral patterns, layered textures, and the patterned carpet that keeps the space cozy and appealing. The sale of the mega mansion was marked as the third highest sale in Orange County history. The agent that brokered that deal was real estate agent Josh Altman from the Bravo TV show Million Dollar Listing Los Angeles. The sale of the mansion will be documented on the show's 14th season, premiering on December 8 on Bravo. Heather Ray Yell Mousa, the cast member of Selling Sunset on Netflix, was the real estate agent that sold the Du Bros a $14 million penthouse in Los Angeles called the Cavelli Penthouse. The penthouse has two large bedrooms, four and a half baths, and is 5,254 square feet. Cavelli Penthouse is set within the 38th floor of the coveted Century Building. The penthouse has a bold design statement by the Jumbo Collection. The penthouse is sprawling south, faces views overlooking the Pacific Ocean. This newly renovated penthouse showcases custom finishes and furnishings from Cavalli and Fair, which is included in the purchase. This was Heather Ray Yell Mouse's biggest real estate deal. The interior boasts a flexible layout with a Gianfranco Fair designed kitchen, two large bedrooms with luxurious baths and suite, massive walk in custom closets, a private sauna, two additional private terraces, and a separate office with library. The Century features extensive gardens designed by landscape architect Pamela Burton, concierge, gated security, a pool and jacuzzi with private cabanas, fitness studio, movie theater, business center, and valet parking. The alleged rumor of Terry Dubrow cheating on Heather started back in September of this year. The Housewives of Orange County is in the process of filming season 17 and Heather is nowhere to be seen. The word on the street is, she has not been seen filming with the other housewives since the cheating allegations surfaced. However, Heather shoots down these alleged rumors by stating to the media that they are not true on any level. It's possible that she was not filming because her priority was getting her twins off to college and there may have been a lot of challenges with doing that. Who knows? We just have to wait and check out the upcoming season. If you've enjoyed this video, please subscribe to my channel and hit the notification button for more videos. Thanks for watching. Stay safe, stay sweet, and keep the peace.